For this video, I'm going to be taking a look at the Castillo de San Marcos, the oldest masonry fort in the continental United States. Once again, I decided to drop into St. Augustine, Florida, and I'm visiting the Castillo de San Marcos National Monument. This fort was constructed back when um, Florida was part of the Spanish Empire. Uh, construction began in 1672. St. Augustine had been established about 107 years earlier uh, by Spanish Admiral and Conquistador Pedro Menendez de Aviles. St. Augustine itself would remain as part of the Spanish Empire up into 1763 when Britain uh, gained control over Florida in the Treaty of Paris. The United States of America would take possession of the fort in 1821 and a little over 100 years later in 1933 this fort uh, transferred over to the National Park Service who has been operating it as a national monument ever since. Every time that I come to St. Augustine, Florida, I'm always pleasantly surprised by something new. And this particular trip, this was my um, hidden gem of the vacation. I just was fascinated by the European history that is built into this place. No matter where you go in the city, you can experience the, the Spanish influence and heritage um, in the, the food, the sculptures, the architecture, the historic sites. Uh, the art galleries, pretty much every place in St. Augustine has that vibe, and it's just a wonderful thing to experience. There's an old adage that a picture is worth a thousand words. So let's uh, sit back and let St. Augustine talk to you as we uh, take a closer look at uh, the Castillo de San Marcos. <laughs> enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm incredibly grateful for all the support that I've gotten from uh, both the YouTube community as well as the Daily Motion community. I am forever grateful.